notice a difference in you know, year two, kind of with the system and more time with Coach Lynch as your quarterback's coach and as the play caller as well? Yeah, uh, it's, the difference is crazy. Where we were a year ago, where we were three weeks ago is, is it's incomparable. I think we, uh, now with our offense, we, we've established a flow. Uh, we have an identity to our offense. And just like anything, there's a level of consistency. So we have guys, um, you know, just relearning. It's not, you know, learning it for the first time. And so we're able to play fast and play loose out there. So you see, I think if you notice out here, it's just a whole lot of guys just playing more comfortable. So but that's the main thing. Yeah, I think uh, one thing I wanted to focus on was just relationship with just all of my teammates uh, on the offense, uh, on the defense, special teams, you know. And so that starts in the winter. So in the winter time, just um, make sure I'm hanging out with more guys. And what I wanted to focus on specifically during that winter period as far as myself was relationship and time with our receivers. So um, whether it's time and routes, whether it's, you know, working on different throws, working on different angles and things like that. Um, you go back and just watch what a lot of our problems were last year as far as the throw game was just about timing and understanding all right, which guy breaks the fastest, which guy is, you know, uh, easier coming out of their breaks. And so that's what I really focus on. Yeah, um, Q is, he's working. I mean, he, he was one of those guys who, who's embracing that role of, of stepping up with um, some guys just leaving. And I'm proud of, proud of I'm proud of all of our receivers. All of our receivers have, have been working really hard. And like I said, throughout that entire winter period, we are working on relationship and just time, like constantly, all right, getting throws in every single day. And so um, that level of focus, you know, earlier is showing up here. And so I'm proud of all of those guys. Like you have a lot of guys on this team who probably had some other options if they wanted to try to go somewhere else. So get a lot of these key guys back. What did that tell you about kind of the buy-in and the seriousness? Yeah, I think the main thing is like, we believe in this team. A lot of guys, we believe, we believe, every guy you see out here believes in this team. We believe in Coach Lee and we believe in Vanderbilt. Uh, we came here for a reason to win. And so that's our common goal. And so everybody here is, is dialed in, locked in and bought in. And so of course you, you got, there's some guys who left and respects to those guys, but the guys who are here, we're ready to go. And so that's the main thing we're bought in. And, we love Vanderbilt football. That's the reason why we're here, and that's the reason we're going to win football games. So. Is there something about last season that you think created that optimism that, that, that yeah. there is success ahead of you? Mm -hmm. For sure. I think when you, whenever you have a chance to just go back and reflect, you realize so many games where it's like, oh, we're right there. We're right there. We just got to get over the hump. And like I said, we believe in Coach Lee. We believe in this program. We believe in all We believe in the defense. We believe in the special teams. That level of belief is the highest it's ever been right now. So we know it's there. We can feel it. And so um, from the outside in, I don't know what it looks like, but from the inside out, everybody has that feeling like it is time to go. We are ready to go. We're going to make it happen. So. Uh, I've seen you like run some option with Jaden McGowan, even though he's a receiver. Um, what sort of different dimension do you think he might bring to the offense? Yeah, um, Jaden Jaden McGowan is really talented. He's a really talented guy. Um, He's a he's a football player. That's what I call him. He's a football player. He can be put outside, put inside, do different things. And like I said, that receiver core is very talented and very versatile. We can line up every single receiver inside and outside. And they can do different things. And um, with his with his level of speed, that's why his nickname is Shake. It says he can shake defenders and, and and literally just tell them to go play ball, put the ball in his hands, let him go work. And so uh, we got we got a talented group. So I'm proud of him. He's come in and learn the playbook really well. And so just trying to get him as many touches as we can. So. How was paintball? Oh, my goodness. <laughs> so I talk a lot of trash to our defense. So there was a bigger target on my back out there at paintball. So, uh, yeah, I'll, I'll put it I'll put it at that. I got, I, got a few, I got a few hits in, but I took more than I gave. So. <laughs> Thanks, everybody. Good. All right, awesome. Thank, Thank you. you. I appreciate it.